Hey everyone and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. On this video, we're finishing up the stranger mission, A Fisher of Fish. We got about halfway through on the last video and it's time to do the other half. So if we take a look, oh, not at our map, at our compendium, we are now 420 of 553. But what we're really concerned about is the fish category, which is 20 of 30. For the regular fish page, we have four fish that we have not yet caught with the correct bait, and two we haven't caught at all. For legendaries, there's eight remaining. We're going to be catching seven of those on this video. Man, I should have held circle there. All right, so we're going to start by catching a perch. You'll need bread bait for a perch. Um, I assume you could catch some in the okay, Elysian girl. pool. Let's go. Because that's where we just caught the legendary perch. But I hate the Elysian pool now, after how long it took to catch that guy. So I'm going to go to another place. That would be just west of Beaver Hollow. Also, if my voice sounds a little bit raspy, I've been sick recently, so my voice might sound a little off. Fortunately, I'm a little too north to find any beavers. I could really use a beaver. I'm going to cut across here. I'm going to try to steer clear of Beaver Hollow. The Murphrys have most likely moved back in. And I really have no reason to kill them. Oh, that's... That current is too strong. Let me go up river a little bit. But yeah, I have no reason to kill the Murphys right now. The only reason I might want to is to get the hat challenge done, but they don't wear hats. They're heathens. Or at least if they do, they don't often wear hats, so... The likelihood of me finding three that I could shoot off in their hats in one dead eye is very low. Alright, so I th I think this was about the spot. This looks about right. Let's see if we can catch a perch. Sometimes they're stubborn. Sometimes all these fish are stubborn. You just throw it in and hope for the best. Okay. Let's see what's what down there. Okay, got something. It's probably reeling in a little too easy to be a perch. Got you, partner. What is that? That is... Oh, it's a perch! Not well, a perch. look at that. Done already. Efficiency. Alright, so let's verify on the compendium. And perch, now 100%. Alright, uh, next we're going to catch a new fish. That would be a northern pike. And uh, there's a really easy spot to get them right there. There's some shallow water that for some reason they're in. And yeah, you can just see it. Well, hello. Oops. Wrong way. Here we go. Alright, so this shallow water is where I've seen them before. And sure enough, I think that's one right there. Alright, and uh, I believe this one is a river lure. He 
He's got to turn around. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's looking at it now. Oh. Oh, never mind. I didn't realize it was that close to his mouth. He got nowhere to go, man. Got him. That is a fish. Okay, Northern Pike caught. Survivalist 10 updated. And Compendium updated. Northern Pike can be found in Northern Rivers. This large predator can prove tricky to catch, as it struggles fiercely when threatened. River lores are known to catch the Northern Pike's eye, while food baits hold no appeal. They are most active when the skies are gray and overcast. A massive, legendary Northern Pike is supposed to exist, or have existed, somewhere in the Grizzlies. Alright, uh, I have no reason to keep this guy, so let's throw him back. Alright. Moving on. Come on, girl. One more time. I think it's time for a legendary fish. So let's head up to this one. But before we do, let's go say hi to Charlotte. See if she's still living out there. Not sure if she gets many visitors out there in the middle of nowhere. And her neighbor was a crazy scientist guy who released some machine out into the wild. Apparently I can actually find that machine, so I'm going to have to do that at some point. Speaking of the scientist, there's his place right there. Oh, something up here is angry. Oh, sounds like a cougar. No, Rachel! Oh, oh wow, it's it's right there. Hi. Oh, good thing it didn't bite me as soon as I got knocked off. One star skin. It's not gonna do me any good. Thanks for the assist, Rachel. Appreciate it. Rachel's gonna get me killed and then just steal all the carrots from my satchel. I know what you're up to, Rachel. friend of mine, a fella called Arthur Morgan, came by and helped you with some hunting and skinning probably seven or eight years back. Yes, of course. Well, I wouldn't be here right now if it wasn't for him. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, he passed soon after. I figured he might not have had long left. Such a shame. He found me at my lowest point and he lifted me up. Glad to see you're doing well, ma'am. He wrote fondly of you. Oh, I couldn't be happier. Listen, it, it's a long way out here. You're welcome to take whatever you need from the house for your travel. No, no, that ain't necessary. Please, I have everything I need and more. But he gave me the ability to survive. And now I'm writing. Any friend of Arthur's is a friend of mine. Please take something. It would make me happy. Well, that's very kind of you, ma'am. All right. I will help myself. Let's see what she got. 
Ooh, I see premium cigarettes. I want those. Vistas of America card 8. Apparently I already had it. That's unfortunate. World Champions card 9. That's a new one. For some reason it's not letting me see it. Here we go. Who we got here? Edwin Singerly. Alright, that's our fifth card in that set. We also got some crackers, some cocaine gum, some gin. Oh, some more premium cigarettes. Sweet. Marvels of Travel card 7. U.S. Frigate. Ooh, that's only our second one in this set. We're slacking big time on that one. Alright, anything else we want to take here? Uh, maybe whatever's on here. Yeah, it's a miracle tonic. Alright, that'll work. Alright, I don't want to ransack her whole place. You take care of yourself out here, ma'am. <laughs> Just ignored me. All right. Well, glad to see that Charlotte is doing well. Looks like a true frontiers woman. I don't actually know if that's a word. Frontiers woman? Would she be a frontiersman? Maybe. I don't know. All right. Anyways, our legendary fish is right here. And for this one, we want the special lake, or not lake lore, the special river lore. Uh -huh. All right, Let's see if we can get any interest. See a. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's a. No, never mind. Thought I was seeing a fish, but it's just reflection looking a little odd. Probably didn't cast this out far enough. Yeah, let me cast this out. Oh, wait. Are you coming over? No. Oh, yep. There we go. Right at the edge. Alright, well, should be able to get him pretty easily with him so close. Musky? That's not what I'm looking for. Throw that crap back. You're not the one. Yeah, scoot up there. We go. All right, cast this a little bit further. Our friend's probably a bit out there in the deeper water. Hopefully, rain doesn't scare him away. We got something. I can't quite see him. Not sure if this is it either. Lucky you. Looks like another musky. What the heck? I don't want you. Go away. That better not be the same one. I didn't look at the size. Alright, musky, leave it alone. I want the big guy. Got something. 
no visual on it yet. Better not be a freaking musky. It's kind of looking like a musky. <laughs> no, what? Whoa, okay. Oh my god. Alright, I don't know if this is the same one, but I'm keeping him and I'm throwing him off to the side because that's what he gets. There. There's water there, you'll figure out how to survive. Okay. I'll pull all the musky out of this river, I don't care. I'm catching my legendary. I'll have a pile of musky over here. We'll feed the bears well tonight. They don't even have to look for them. Oh, there it is. That's the one. You're the one I've been looking for. What's that? What? I wasn't even... What? All right, hold on. Oh, I see him going that way. Hopefully I can catch him while he goes around that rock. I don't know what happened there. I wasn't even reeling in and he broke my line. I've never seen that before. Hopefully we can get his attention again though. He came darting over here. Oh, I think that's him again. Yep. All right, buddy. You're not getting away this time. If he's like, what the? What is going on? I have no idea. What? What are you doing, fish? He was like trying to catch himself, but then he like went into the rocks and disappeared or something. I'm very confused. As long as he gets on the line again, I don't care. He can be as weird as he wants. Oh. I thought I saw movement, but maybe not. Looked like something was darting. Oh, there he is. Yeah, that's him. Alright. I'm not reeling. There. Alright, get over here. I'm done with your crap. Pain in the butt. Steelhead, wow. Jeez, look at that thing. <laughs> Alright, that uh, updates Survivalist Challenge. And the Compendium. The legendary Steelhead Trout has been spotted by fishermen near Willard's Rest. Special river lures are the most successful way to catch this species of fish. Trout are known for being more active during rainy weather. Reports suggest that this legendary steelhead trout could weigh over 20 pounds, with the length of the fish reaching over 50 inches. Yeah, he's pretty large. We're keeping him, sure. Unlike that musky, who's going to be feeding the bears. Alright. Legendary caught. And we are getting out of here. So, let's head back into Annisburg. There is a weapon we can get about right there. I'm also heading into Annisburg just so I can mail this fish, and I also just don't need to be in this general area at all. We're far to the east, we're going west. All right. 
Just about back in Annisburg. Uh, so we're look what we're looking for is a hatchet in a log and a stump. And I think I actually marked the stump. But I'm not sure. If I didn't put it right on the mark, it's close. You almost killed a maniac! Uh Yep, there it is. Perfect. Oh, I was a little off. I had marked the outhouse. Rusted double bit hatchet. Um, strange. I busted the thing somehow. Did I go too quick? There it is. A rare hatchet featuring a rusted double bladed head. One razor sharp side for chopping and cutting, and the dull side for splitting wood. This melee weapon was found in a tree stump near Annisburg Mine in Roanoke Ridge, and has been worn by the elements over time. This hatchet can also be thrown. Alright, new weapon. I'm carrying it around. I'm gonna intimidate people. Did you look at me funny? Start something, huh? I should actually probably put this away. People are so prickly in this game, they might start shooting. None of you seem to be listening. How do you do? I've been here for five years or more now, and the world is getting worse. Listen to me. <laughs> five years. All right, let's mail this fish. Howdy. Howdy. Oh, same here. What you need to send? All right, legendary perch and legendary steelhead trout. It'll be there before you know it. That gets a seven of thirteen. Six to go. So let's take a train to Valentine. Enjoy your destination. All right, Rachel, let's go. So our next stop is gonna be this legendary fish down here. I shouldn't need any animals or anything in this area, unless I see a, well, I do need a chipmunk, three-star chipmunk, and, uh, I still need a gray squirrel for my compendium. That gray squirrel has been surprisingly elusive. Not seeing any squirrels or chipmunks. Not that it's easy to spot them while going full speed on a horse, but if I did see them, I would stop and get them. Hey, hey, easy. A little muskrat. Might actually need a muskrat. But he's only a two star. Alright, so this is the place. 
For this one, we need a special river lore. Which we have. No, I don't... I don't know if I cast it that far enough. Guess we'll find out. Unlike the bigger fish, we're unlikely to actually see this one. Because it's a chain pickerel. Which are not exactly large. This might actually be it. You kidding me? Yes! <laughs> and that's the one. The legendary chain pickerel has recently been sighted in the Dakota River. Fishermen have mentioned that the only way to attract this fish is by using special river lures. Reports suggest that the activity of this fish increases on sunny days. Fishermen and locals state that the size of this legendary chain pickerel could be over nine or yeah, could be over 19 inches long and weighing around nine pounds. What are you? A pickerel? Afraid I'm keeping you. All right. Let's move on. Uh, we still need to get a sockeye salmon with the correct bait. And I have found sockeye salmon, I believe it was down here. Let's place a marker there. I think that was the place. So let's go see if we can get one. It should be easy to spot. They are very red. up on the wrong side of the river, but I guess that really doesn't matter. Let's see. I can't quite tell. Well, there's one way to find out. You just cast and see what happens. I might have caught a glint of red, but hard to say. I believe it's river lore for this. Yeah. The tooltip's helping me out, so river lore for sure. Toss this in. Just saw some fish right there. I can't tell if they're red or not. Okay, no bites. Let's try over there. Hmm. Not seeing any red fish. Oh, actually, I thought I just saw... Come on. That one looks slightly red. Hard to say. Oh, that, there's a red one in there. I just saw something red. In fact, I might have a red one. Yep, there we go. You, sir, are a fish. Uh, keep... Hello, sir. Hey, mister. All right, let's check the compendium, make sure everything looks correct. And indeed. All right, so the only two we need to fill out, largemouth bass and steelhead trout, and then we still need a channel catfish. 
Alright, time to go get another legendary. This one's far to the north. We're going all the way up to Lake Isabella. And uh, let's just go ahead and cross the river. Right, we're going up into the cold. I'm not properly dressed, but I never am. It's fine. I'll just use items. Too lazy to switch. Oh, why couldn't you be wearing a hat? Jump down off that horse. I don't think so. Don't think so. Did you just shoot Rachel? Oh, you are dead. Poor Rachel. Now you're all dead. Happy? Poor Rachel. Took it like a champ, though. Oh, whoops. Why am I picking you up? I meant to loot you. Well, that's how angry you made me by hurting Rachel. You picked up and then you get thrown again. How do you like that? Poor Rachel. I'm also mad that this guy wasn't wearing a hat. Could have got my challenge done. Speaking of hats, I should probably put my hat on. My girl. Let's put that hat on. John's classic hat. Now, there is one thing I could use up here, but... I don't foresee actually getting it. Um, I could use the uh, Timberwolf. I believe I need everything on I need to study it, kill it, and skin it. The problem with Timberwolves is the study part is kind of difficult because they will likely be attacking me before uh, I find them. So at some point, I'll probably have to come in here and just sort of like sneak around until I find some tracks on one of them. Because otherwise, every time I see wolves, they're already attacking me and it doesn't let me study them when they're doing that. Do or at least it hasn't for me. Plus, that's dangerous business anyway, trying to study things while they're trying to kill you. Rachel's slowing down a little bit. At least it feels like it. Maybe the snow is actually reducing her speed. I don't know. Certainly wouldn't surprise me with this game, but I've never actually tested it. It would make sense, though. Cold weather is starting to affect me. Health core is going to start dropping, but that's fine. That's why we have crackers and biscuits and things. Besides, we're not going to be up here for long. It would be a clothing change for like a few minutes. Alright, so we made it. Uh, this one lies a little bit. 
It actually took me a while to figure it out. So, ignore the map marker. It shows it here. You're actually going to fish in this area. If you fish down there, you won't get it. And you'll want the special lake lore for this one. Alright, let's see if it's out there. Ooh, something just jumped over there. Oh, here it comes. Oh yeah, that's him. Not biting, though. Oh, come on. You know you want it. Oh, he left? Oh, wait. Got him. Hey, big guy. Holy crap. All right. Reel him in. Gotcha. Shit. That's you. All right. All right, legendary sockeye salmon. The legendary sockeye salmon can be found in Lake Isabella. Fishermen have reported that the best way to attract this fish is with special lake lures on an overcast day. Rumors suggest that the size of this sockeye salmon could be around 50 inches long and weighing over 50 pounds. I shall keep you. Hey. All right. Let's go, girl. Rachel, if you could not dump on my horse, that'd be really good. All right, so since we're in the area, let's actually go up to Mount Hagen where we had the final battle with Micah. There's something special up there for us. Not paying attention to my mini map. This way. Good thing I have this mini map where I would never navigate this successfully. Oh, see? I'm trying to go completely the wrong way. Alright, so now I know where we are. For some reason, all the campfires and lanterns are still on. That's really odd. Maybe somebody else came through recently. Maybe they've risen from the dead. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Rachel, calm down. That's awesome. They just left Micah right where I killed him. Hi, Micah. How are you doing? That's unfortunate for you. I'm going to take your revolver. This old double action revolver features a blackened steel frame and a custom red and black skull grip. At some point, the words Vengeance is hereby mine were etched into the barrel. This previously belonged to Micah Bell, but he won't be needing it anymore. This gun has an ammo capacity of six rounds and can use regular, high velocity, split point, express, and explosive revolver ammo. Ah, feels good to kill a man, take his weapon. It's a long time coming, Micah. But it felt good in the end. 
All right, so we need to mail this fish. Let's go all the way to Strawberry. And good. I was actually hoping we would take this path. I believe it's somewhere around here. We can actually potentially get that special event to get a treasure map, which we need for one of our challenges, which I screwed up not that long ago. So, redemption. Hopefully. All right, now to get down the mountain. Oops. Uh, let's see. Go slowly here. Oh wait, not that way. Ah, it's so confusing. All right, here is where they want me to go. All right, got it. I guess I could have really just followed my previous tracks, but I wasn't paying attention. All right. So pretty soon we'll be out of the snow and that'll be nice. Typically run into wolves in this area, so I'm fully expecting it, and there they are, right on cue. If only I could study them right now without dying. I mean, maybe a little risky. Oh, they give up already? I gave up super fast. All right, whatever. I don't think it would have worked anyway. Now, oh, and I should probably fix my health core just in case anything happens. Always good to have a full health bar to work with. So hopefully we do get that event with the the dude with the treasure map. That would be great. Just because I'm already out here. It's not the only place he can spawn. I know of one other. There's probably more. But hopefully he just is there now. That would be wonderful. Well, this is starting to seem like the wrong way. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Just felt wrong. Hmm. Wonder who's over here. I'm gonna sneak in. For some reason, I'm getting a feeling this is... Something bad. Oh, actually, it could be... Oh, I hope it's O'Driscoll's. That would be amazing. Because I need one more camp clear for them. Ow. Oh, never mind. It's not O'Driscoll's. I don't know what it is. Abandoned? Seems abandoned. Oh wait, no, there's a dude here. Easy. You don't need to be here. Go away. All right. So grumpy. You know what to do, girl. He had a hat. I didn't see if his friend did, but there was only two. If they all had hats, I'd probably start some crap with them just to shoot their hats off. More wolves. My god! What did I do to piss off every wolf? Or wolf. Wolf. We'll call them wolf. Singular. 
Oops. Uh, I can't figure out where I'm going. I'm going this way, apparently. This does not seem like the right way. But I'm going to trust it. Er, uh, no, this is the right way. Alright, so potentially coming up soon. Oh, that might be him. Yes! Alright, I'm gonna be a jerk. Rob him. This is as nice as I'm gonna ask. Hand it over. Now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ain't no need for that. Take it. It's cursed anyway. Alright, we got it. It's just getting stronger and stronger. That is the high stakes treasure map one. And we need to find a waterfall somewhere. So we'll be working on that real soon. Alright, good. Don't have to worry about that anymore. Oh, is that a gray squirrel? Black squirrel. How about that one? That was black too. Black squirrel. Alright, so we need to sell this fish. Or not sell it, uh, mail it. the information business the law is just getting too suspicious it was good while it lasted but there we go that's not why I'm why I'm here okay where's it going legendary chain pickerel mailed legendary sockeye salmon mailed it will be there before you know it all right we are 9 of 13 four left See ya. all right so Oops, that's not what I want. I want the map. Next one we're going to get down at Owenjila. I never know how to pronounce that. Rachel's core is getting sort of low, but I think they're fine. Wait, there is there's an event of some sort going on. Is it gone now? Oh, it's still there. Oh, it might be that mad preacher. Is he down here? This is one of his spots. Yep, I found him. Hey, buddy. Have you spoken to 
To him. To who? To him! I don't think so. Have you? Oh, yeah. I, I, I've spoken all the time, but... He's ignoring me. He's, he's, he hates me. He hates me. Alrighty. Crazy as always. Good girl. Let's go. Alright. I already have a marker down. I forgot. Alright. Continuing on with the fish. From Laramie. The range out here is. Uh, I know these guys. They're actually pretty rough. Uh, get your gun ready. Guess we'll be using Micah's revolver. Real inhospitable. You see, we're paid to make it that way. Bomb solved. Yeah, I've had them shoot me first before and they'll just like stun lock you it's nasty yeah yeah move along nothing to see here right, other guy got dragged off I don't I don't really care about him unless he's nearby nah you got dragged super far away. Alright, moving on. Yeah, I don't know what is up with those particular guys, but uh, just be careful with them. They pack some serious damage. Get him real quick. I might be able to pull his corpse in. Oh, he's probably out of range now. There's actually two of them. Oh, well, their corpses might get dragged to the water. Or to the uh, shore. To the water. They're in the water. Yeah, I think they're actually going to. Good. Hopefully one of them is a three star. Yep, they're coming this way. That's wonderful. Hopefully I can get them though. Water actually looks pretty deep. Oh, what the heck? No, it sank. Oh, that's so dumb. Well, I didn't know that would happen. Well, crap. So much for that. Alrighty, well, hopefully I didn't scare away the fish. So, for this one, we need a special lake lure. Which we already have. And, let's see if he's biting. I actually don't know if you can scare off fish with gunfire. Hopefully that has not happened. Almost the shore. If he's gonna bite, it better be soon. There he is. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's him. Got him close to shore, too. You get back here, buddy. Got him. Beautiful. Shit. 
it. Yes. Legendary smallmouth bass. The legendary smallmouth bass can be found in the waters of Owangila. Special lake lures should be used for a successful catch. Locals have stated that this fish is most active when it is raining. Local fishermen have estimated the size of the legendary smallmouth bass to be around 50 inches long and weighing in at over 20 pounds. All right, keeping for sure. Just throw it on the back of Rachel and we'll have to go back to Strawberry and mail it because it's just too big. Can't just carry it around in the old satchel. Alright, so marker on the post office. Raccoon. Looks a little different. <laughs> For a second, I thought it was an armadillo. Sorry. Easy. What we got there? Those rabbits? Hey, a little black rat. I actually need a rat. Let's see. Oh, crap. Wrong button. Uh, let's see. I want small game. Arrow. Where did he go? There you are, you little rat. He's moving quick. Holy crap. I was not expecting a rat to be that fast. Where did he go? There he is. Alright, got him. Can't remember how many rat carcasses I needed, but I think it's actually fairly significant. Look out, piggies! I'm coming through. Okay. We're back. You can cover postage. Okay, legendary smallmouth bass. There All we go. Right, we'll send this out for you. You have mailed at least ten legendary fish to Jeremy Gill. Return to any post office after at least twenty-four hours for your you reward. Okay, Thanks. Go. All right, so just three left. We're so close. Next one we're gonna get is that Aurora Basin. Just put the marker there. All right, a little bit of a trip for this one. This is the this is the closest place we can really go. It's too bad I can't fast travel to the house. Cause that would have been better. But other than that, strawberry is pretty much the place you gotta go. Hoping three bandits with hats harass me. 
exactly three, all standing right next to each other. That would be wonderful. Easy now. Oh, I thought there was some event happening. That dude was just mad at me. Horse's health will refill slower. Yeah, yeah, I know it's cores a little low, but I want to get more use out of that carrot. Rachel can wait. Going for efficiency. Alright, so I'm back in Skinner territory. I do at some point need to clear out one more of their camps so hopefully at some point we can make that happen who's this guy oh my god it's him goodbye nobody can help you gavin's friend Place. Okay, obviously, you want the legend, or I keep calling it legendary, you want the special lake lore here. And let's see what's biting. Actually, while I'm here, I should probably try to get a largemouth bass out of here as well. Bet you we could get one. Alright, we got something. It's coming towards me, which is odd. Shit! That's you! Alright! And we got the legendary rock bass. The legendary rock bass was last reported inhabiting the Aurora Basin. The best way to attract this fish is with special lake lures. Most sightings of this fish have occurred on sunnier days. Reports suggest that this legendary rock bass could weigh around 3 pounds with the length of the fish reaching 50 inches. Alright, so that was easy. Luckily this one will go right into the satchel. And uh, yeah, let's throw a few casts out there with crayfish. Hopefully a largemouth bass is in there. And if that's true, then we would just have one regular fish remaining. I think largemouth bass can actually pretty much be in any of the rivers or lakes, but they seem somewhat uncommon. It's just my experience, though. Whatever that fish is, seems interested. Can't quite tell what it is. No, it might be a bass. You, sir, oh! Are a fish. Is that largemouth? Largemouth bass! Beautiful! We'll keep you. Alright, well that worked fantastic. All right, so let's check the compendium now. All right, this page is looking great. So, oh, right, I forgot. We still have to get uh, steelhead trout as well. But I know where we can do that. So, need to get steelhead trout with worms, I believe. And then we need that channel catfish. Getting close. And we have, what is it? Two legendary fish remaining. And I guess I could be good to Rachel and brush her off. That's my lady. I normally don't bother, but Rachel's earned it. You're so good, Rachel, you get a second brush. Okay. 
So, let's head down to Stillwater Creek, get this legendary fish, and we're also going to look around for that Fertilance snake, because that can be in there. We'll get the fish first. Who's my girl? And like I said, if we happen to run into a Skinner camp, that would certainly not be a bad thing. In fact, I could check that one spot. I think I will check that one spot. Lady. Cause I do so enjoy killing skinners. So that camp is uh, this way, I think. Yeah, it should be a turn off. I think it's up this way. Yeah. Okay. I remembered. I don't need no map. Let's see if they're up there. Right up here, right? I think this is it. Let's go see if anyone's home. Wait, what the heck? And if they are, there should be three of them standing together with hats. Wait, this is it, right? I'm not just... Okay, good. I'm not just running up to some random area. Yep. Yeah. No camp. Pretty sure they can come back once you clear them out, but there's nothing there now. Come on, girl. One right. more time. Let's get out of here. Okay, I believe we're pretty much here. One of these lakes. Or ponds, really. I think it's technically a lake, but it's really a pond. Actually, oh god! Well, that, that sucked. Sorry, Rachel. There was a snake back here. I want to make sure it's not a fur to lance. Black-tailed rattlesnake. Well, it is a three-star. I'm pretty sure I still needed rattlesnake skin, so let's go get it. <laughs> Rachel's following me, but she's not going to follow me for long. Once she figures out what I'm doing. All right, I went this way. There it is. Throw me off my horse, will ya? 
Oh wait, I just killed it with a regular arrow. I am so dumb. <laughs> Dang it! Well, before I forget, uh, let's make small game arrows. That reminded me that I need to make some more. But yeah, that was a waste. I think I can make ten of them. Got lots of flight feathers. Oh, never mind. I wasn't counting, but it looked like about five. I don't know why I thought I need to shoot that with a regular arrow. Oh well. Okay, here we are. Easy now. I'm trying to remember if this one was a swamp lore or a river lore or a lake lore. I think it's lake. Yeah, I'm gonna use a lake lore. I mean, we'll find out real quick. It's a small area, and he's in here. So, if he doesn't like this, I've got other options, but I'm pretty sure it's a lake lore. Something likes it. Something big. Well, not that big, but. Pleased to meet you. Well, is it big enough? Nope, that's just a largemouth bass. Well, apparently I could have caught it here too. I like to keep them close to shore whenever possible. That way I can reel it in in like two seconds. Not sure if this is one eye. This looks mighty small. Gotcha. I damn well gotcha. Shit. No, oh, well, this is the one. Oh, that's right. I forgot it's a redfin pickerel. Those are small. The legendary redfin pickerel has been sighted in Stillwater Creek by local fishermen. Like other pickerel, this fish preferred, uh, prefers warm, sunny weather and special river lures. Oh, well, I used a lake one. The estimated size of this legendary redfin pickerel is considered to be around 19 inches and weighing over 10 pounds. Sorry, but you're coming. So apparently it's not too picky. River or lake, it'll take either. Supposedly. Okay, that's done. We only have one legendary fish left. Well, we technically have two, but one left for our mission. And like I said, I want to see if that fertile ants is hanging out. Let's actually make sure we kill him with the correct ammo. Alright, so I've seen him in this general area. As usual, Rachel will probably find him before I do if he's actually here. Though I'm not seeing him. We'll do one pass around here. But yeah, once again. Looks like he's nowhere to be found. Which is quite unfortunate. Let me check over here too. I wonder if I like just thinking of the wrong spot or something. Whoa now. Seems odd that there'd be nothing. 
Look at the map again. No, I'm pretty sure it was right in there. We'll check this little spot as well, and there's nothing I'll give up the search for now. And sure enough, I'm not seeing anything. Alrighty. That's fine. So, our final legendary fish is, let's see, I think it was down here, near Lake Don Julio, if I recall correctly. Yeah, pretty sure that's it. So, we got, we got a ways to go. And very soon, Rachel's going to get that carrot. Not quite yet, like I said, efficiency. But she's almost earned it. Oh, and I don't need this bow on, I'm just gonna scare people. Oh, and while I'm out here, um, I think one of the herbs I have not grabbed is red sage at least if I have I really don't remember doing it so if I see any red sage out here I'm definitely gonna grab it because I have seen it out here a bunch of wild horses up there what's going on well those oh, look like riders couldn't quite tell it was a little blurry That is one possibility out here. Every once in a while, the Del Lobos will cause problems with me, and they almost always have hats. They're quite fond of hats. So hopefully they'll come stir up some trouble. And be standing next to each other. Rachel's not too pleased with me at the moment. All right, Rachel, you've earned it. You've earned the carrot. There you go. A well-deserved carrot. And a little bit of a rest. Look how spoiled she is. Now we can go again. I have unopened mail or parcels. Looks like I got my reward for sending in 10, but I've almost got the rest. Something happening over there? I see a symbol popping up. What am I seeing on the mini map? There's something over there. I can't quite tell. I'm gonna go see what that is. I'm very curious. Oh! Oh, well, it seems to be gone now. Oh, oh, I should probably be paying attention. I have no idea what that was. It was something. Oh well. I got other things to do. Alright, so we're really close. Like I said, I think it's right over here. I'm 
Maybe this isn't it. <laughs> oh, no, this is it. Slow now. Okay, let's look at the map. And yep, right here. I remembered well. Hey, hey, easy. Okay. Uh, for this one, I believe we actually need the river lore. How's about this? And let's see what's biting. Oh, that's the oh! I almost didn't press R two. I kind of spaced out. All right, that's clearly the one. Get over here, you big monster. All right, got it. Legendary Largemouth Bass. The legendary largemouth bass is rumored to inhabit the San Luis River. Uh, like other largemouth basses, the best way to attract this fish is during rainy weather with a special river lure. It is estimated that this legendary largemouth bass could be over 50 inches long and weigh over 20 pounds. That's probably the San Luis River, but whatever. Alright, so you can see our... Compendium looking quite nice at the moment. Put you back. Just missing the one legendary. Put that on there. Alright, so we need a place to mail this. I don't know if there's many out here. Let's see. We could go to Armadillo, but they don't have a mailbox. Honestly, don't even know if Tumbleweed does. Tumbleweed doesn't either. Well, I guess we'll go... Yeah, I guess we'll go to Armadillo just to fast travel out. And, yeah, we'll just basically cut across. Okay. That'll work. There is that symbol again. What is happening? Alright, I am very curious. I need to go check this out. I must know what the heck that is. Although it's gone again. I wonder if it's something at that house over there. I don't know. I'm gonna go look. Can we get to that house? Yeah. Is something happening over here? I mean, I've been here before. I don't remember anything special. Hey, Joel. He's stubborn now. Alright, well, since I don't know what the heck is happening, I'm going in armed. Nothing. Okay. Well... I still have no idea. But whatever. Anyways, let's go to Armadillo. And also, let me give myself a little more health for it. I want to be prepared. Expect the worst. And speaking of expecting the worst, let's make sure stamina and... Dead eye are in a good place too. Okay, well, should be a straight shot. Like I said, if I see any red sage, I'm definitely gonna be picking that up. But not 
seeing any right now. Not seeing much of anything at all. Oh, I actually need these though. Are they three star? Any of you three stars? Bunch of one stars. What do you guys good for? What is that? Well, I'm pretty sure I already have one of these, but picking another just to be sure. Right, well, none of those pigs seem to be decent. So no luck there. Oh, I also need an iguana if I happen to find one. I think I actually need another armadillo too. So I need all kinds of stuff. Not saying anything. Whoa. And let's get out of here. Before I get the cholera. Uh let's go to I'm thinking Rhodes or Lagra. Can I go to Lagra? No. Alright, let's like Rhodes, because I want to go get that channel catfish. Alright, so let me go ahead and mail this before I forget. Alright, I don't know why I'm opening up the map. I know where it is. It's right over here. Alright, so we'll receive mail first. We got $45 in succulent fish meat. Mmm. Let's go ahead and send mail. We got the legendary redfin pickerel, the legendary rock bass, and the legendary largemouth bass. Alright, you have mailed all the legendary fish to Jerry McGill. Or return to any post office after at least 24 hours for your reward. And if I'm not mistaken... He should now have a new mission available, which he currently isn't showing, but maybe you have to wait the 24 hours, but that's fine. We got stuff to do. All right, so there is one place I know of that typically has channel catfish. I guess San Denis was a little bit closer, but whatever. It's in here. I'll drop a waypoint there. And we'll head over. That place seems to consistently have channel catfish. There's other places around the... Around the river that goes north to south near Lagra that I've caught them, but it's hit and miss. This one, I seem to always get one, but I've only tried a few times. Oh, while I'm over here, I believe I can get a new trinket. Wait, am I at the wrong spot? Oh, is he closed? No, he's here. Oh, never mind, he's closed. But he's standing there. Makes perfect sense. You got this, girl. Alright, whatever. I don't need it that badly anyway.
Actually, I wonder... I wonder if there's gonna be any bandits there. With hats. Hats is very important. Rachel keeps randomly slowing down, which makes me think something is happening, and this time it actually is. Is that a cougar? What the heck is a cougar doing over here? Ooh, actually, is it a panther? That'd be amazing. Oh, I can't even see it. This thing blends right in. Oh, crap. Well, that just ruined it. Oh god! What the heck? Why is this thing so strong? Alright, screw this. We're bringing out the real firepower. Just ate those arrows like it was nothing. Ah, oh, crap. That might have been a panther. Easy now. Well, crap. Did I just ruin it? No! <laughs> Why? Ah, uh, I... Dang it. I don't think I could have done anything, really, though. Because it was already after me. But I didn't even know we could get panthers here. And that is good information. I need to remember that. Maybe I could drop a predator lore there. Alright, I don't think I need to skin or do anything to these. But I just want to take a quick look. If I can find them. You a panther? No, panther, panther, panther. Oh, I'm never going to find it in here. Oh, wait. There it is. Never mind. I found it. Yeah, okay. So I... Pretty sure I just needed to study it. Track it and study it, yeah. Well, dang it. But I do know an area where they are now. So that's good. Shocked that I never found them here before, but... At least I got the information. Now, is there anyone out here? Have they moved back in? No, nope, let's abandon. Alrighty, well, I'll leave Rachel here so she doesn't freak out about the alligators. Got weapons with me though, right? Okay. Good, because I don't trust the night folk. <laughs> Never seen night folk over here, but it doesn't mean they couldn't show up. Alright. So, I think this was the place I got it before. Let me look at the map. Yeah, this looks about right. So, let's see if we get any bites. Don't forget, for the channel catfish, you need a swamp floor. Yep. The nice thing about this spot is there's no alligators like Here two inches away this. from me. The alligators are on the other side. So far, no interest. Okay. Should I throw in a little bit farther? See if that's any better. This channel catfish is harder to catch than any of these legendaries except for maybe the perch. Flick it. Where 
but once in a while the camera just goes crazy when you're fishing. Oh, getting nibbles. Got something. Whatever it is, it's big. Maybe? That is a fish. Oh, it's a catfish! Finally, and that finishes Survivalist 10. We got the channel catfish. Channel cats are the most popular catfish species, and the gritty meat is delicious. Blackened. Swamp floors can increase hits. Channel catfish lurk deep in muddy swamp waters, where aquatic plants provide shade and cover. Large, with a keen sense of smell, they find swamp lures irresistible, but ignore most natural baits. They dislike bright sunlight, being most active in overcast weather. In the Rio Bravo border region, the local folklore tells of a colossal legendary channel catfish, but there are no official records of such a creature. The Rio Bravo. Alright, definitely... Oh wait, I don't know why I kept it. Uh, drop this. I don't want it. I was thinking it was legendary because it was just talking about red legendary. All right, so we got new stuff available for uh, from the trapper. Let's go. And we just have one more fish we need to uh, resolve in the compendium. So I know that you can get steelhead uh, trout where I just put down that marker, and we're heading over. What was that noise? Yep, oh, I see some enemies. I'm gonna go say hello. Or possible enemies, I don't know. Let's assume they're enemies. Or, I thought I heard something. The music turned on and everything. Maybe not. I see some dude stuck on his horse over there. Alright, well, never mind. I, I'm i hearing stuff, I guess. Either that or the night folk are messing with me. Thought I heard something. It was an animal. Alright, anyways, let's get out of the swamps. They always creep me out. Not safe. And even less safe now that I know there's panthers about. Panthers just eating arrows like they're nothing. Oh, actually, I just realized I might have been. Was I shooting him with small game arrows? Because that would have made sense. Let's see. I'll know if I'm missing ammo for it. Mm, no, I think I was shooting him with the regulars. Yeah, I don't know. He was just taking it like a champ. Oh, wait. Why am I... Not doing what it's telling me to. Alright, um, once again, I think the only things I need are squirrels, if I see any. Or chipmunks. Chipmunks and squirrels. Well, any chipmunk, and specifically the western gray squirrel.
I think that sound I heard before was a freaking bird because I just heard it again. It sound like a person like giggling. Well, maybe not giggling, but making a weird sound. All right. So, should be able to find steelhead trout in here. Just have to catch one with some worms. Shouldn't take too long. We get 99 tries. I really hope we don't need them all. Would be great if this was one. Although it's reeling in a bit too easy, unlikely. Got it. Bluegill. Right you're coming. Right, let's try a little more. All right. I always forget about this bait. Thumbs nibbling. And I got it. This looks a little more promising. And we got one. Steelhead trout. We'll keep it. And our compendium should be complete for regulars. And all of the legendaries except for one. All right, that looks good. And that looks good. Fantastic. We did it. So I don't believe that next quest is ready to go just yet. But I think that's because we need to wait the 24 hours and then go to the and then go to the uh, mailbox. Well, let's head over. Um, I'll camp just outside of town. Uh, but yeah, we'll head over. We'll camp outside of town. And then uh, on the next video, we'll jump into the second part of the mission. So this is probably a good spot. Easy there. Go ahead and sleep or camp. And we'll sleep until... Well, I guess we'll go until night. Is it ready for us? Huh. Still not seeing it. Oh, legendary fish log updated. Okay, so I think. Wait, what? I'm still not showing anything at the post office. 
Oh, never mind. It just hasn't updated yet. There it is. All right, so we'll be doing that on the next video. I guess we could head right outside of it. That way we can jump right into it. So we're not too far away, but we're not exactly close. Okay, here we are. So, we're all done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.